Less than a week after the National Alliance, the Party of National Unity and the Grand National Union endorsed Uhuru Muigai Kenyatta of the National Alliance as their preferred presidential candidate following a three-hour meeting at the Norfolk Hotel. The Alliance Party of Kenya is working on what it believes is a winning formula for the March 2013 polls. APK leader Kiraitu Murungi insists that unity among like-minded presidential aspirants will be required ahead of the next general election and Uhuru Kenyatta will spearhead a move to unite the candidates. We sent Uhuru with a clear message. We told him to talk with other political leaders. We specifically requested him to talk to the Vice President, Honorable Kronso Musioka. We also asked him to talk to Honorable Musale Mudavadi, Honorable Eugene Wamalo, Honorable Rafael Tuju, and the other presidential candidates uh, who we call the like-minded. The parties have agreed to hold joint campaigns ahead of the March 2013 polls. But that unity strategy has been reportedly misinterpreted by some to mean that TNA, PNU and GNU will also hold joint nominations bringing together candidates for parliamentary and civic posts. Murungi's CIS APK will field its own candidates. We do not want to have joint nomination with other political parties. He said the only joint candidate we are going to have is a presidential candidate. GNU leader Mwangi Kyunjuri had said that the parties were going to deposit a coalition agreement with the Registrar of Political Parties in the next two months to conform to the requirements of the Political Parties Act on coalitions. He says that the Mount Kenya region must unite if the new found coalition is to succeed. And we've been very, very worried about the manner in which the people from the Kenya region have been fragmented. The, the people, the way in which our politicians have been quarreling about political parties and the political leadership. As the campaigns ahead of the 2013 polls hit fever pitch, most parties have opted to join hands with others in newly created coalitions in a move aimed at securing a massive landslide win in the elections that will allow them to form the next government. Abdi Osman, Citizen at One.